Hi, beloved. You're welcome to this prophetic words. The Almighty God bless you. Hallelujah. So, the Lord, if you're just joining in, you know, just subscribe, like, comment, and share. May the Almighty God bless you. Hallelujah. So, the Lord is here this moment. The Lord was, but while I was meditating, the Lord said, someone is going through some emotional situations. Depression, fatigue. Whatever situation that you're going through, the Lord said it's okay. It's okay to feel a certain way sometimes. It's okay to honor the pain that you go through sometimes. It's okay to speak your mind when you're going through a situation sometimes. It's okay to break down and cry when you're going through a situation sometimes. Because only then can you heal at least. Someone is not doing well. Someone has been going through situations. And the Lord said that you are not alone. He's with you. He's with you. I don't know whatever that you're going through in life right now. God is encouraging you to be strong. He's encouraging you to be strong. Someone has got to be strong right now. Okay. The fact that you are a child of God, you are a woman or man of God, doesn't mean that you don't have issues. Like people always do things, you know, against you intentionally or unintentionally and expect you to be just all right. And expect, and expect you to be just okay. To be, you are a human being, okay? And sometimes it's okay to honor the pain that you go through. It's okay to honor the feeling that you go through and, and, and deal with it. We all go through situations. We all go through things. And it's okay sometimes to confront these things. Glory be to God. The Lord said to be strong. Someone has got to be strong right now. God knows you. God understands you. God sees that you've, you've endured pain, a lot of pain. And that needed to be cleared away. And it's okay. If some of you broke down and cried, it's okay. If some of you gave up on certain things, it's okay. If some of you, like, you know, express yourself in an unlikable manner, it's okay. It's okay. It's better for you to express yourself, say your mind, and to, to you know, to free space in your heart rather than keeping things instead of you. Instead of you. Beloved, sometimes fear those who are quiet. Because when they are quiet, they are up to some they're up to no good. But if you have someone that, that can really tell you the way they feel, and then I think it's it's better. It is better. Rather than keeping rather than bearing grudges, keeping someone in their heart. The Lord said that it's okay, release. It's, it's a moment to release. Okay. Take take a long time. If this message, message is not for everybody. Take an alone time to heal, to take care of yourself. The Lord is with you. Most of you are broken hearted this season. It's I feel in the spirit. And the truth is that God allows us to go through through situations in life to be able to understand what other, other people feel. Hallelujah. Yes, God allows us to feel what you feel. God allows, allows us to see what you see, to like navigate through things that people go through to be able to understand what really goes on. So I understand you right now if you're going through situations that are not okay. And that's why God, you know, brought me here to tell, to encourage you, to say to you that it is okay to go through tough times. It is okay to go through sad moments. It's okay to go through depression, through, you know, rejection, through um, conflict, all manner of things. Because, beloved, listen, we've life, you know, there is time for everything. There is time for everything. And unfortunately, it's not so pleasant. This is not so pleasant. When, when a negative aspect of something arises, it's not always pleasant. But we've got to accept it. We've got to accept it. We've got to accept it. When a good time comes, 
we accept the good times. When rough times comes, we learn to accept both. Hallelujah. If there's one thing I've learned in life, is to understand that the amount of good times that you have, be prepared to, to, to <laughs> you know, to experience just so much amount, the, the, almost the amount, just about that amount when negative time comes. So, <laughs> beloved, listen. So, the, God is encouraging, encouraging someone to be strong this season. These two shall pass. These two shall pass. I don't know whatever that you're going through. But the Lord is saying that he's mending your heart. He's mending your heart. You are a child of God. You have a heart. God is not a respecter of any man. He chastises all of us. And sometimes we get to situations, it's a lesson. He wants us to learn some things. Heal and evolve. Hallelujah. Psalms 38 verse 18. The Lord is close to the brokenhearted and saves those who are crushed in spirit. Some of you are brokenhearted right now. You are so crushed in your spirit. So weak, so like, so disappointed in so many things. Some of you are so disappointed in so many things. In your life right now, the Lord says that he's closer to you. He's bringing balance into your life. The Lord your God is bringing balance into your life. God is solving situations in your life. God is giving you, find, giving you a way out of a situation. It's not a moment to play the victim or whatever. But let's just receive, let's just accept what things for what they are and say, Lord, yes, I'm, 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 I'm going through pain. I'm, I'm you know, you know, you, 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 you tell God that, Lord, I, I accept my fault. I accept my error. I, I, I accept that I've gone astray. And, and, and things are going on in my life so I can't even understand. Accept your fault. Accept the pain. Accept, don't, 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 don't pretend about it. The Lord your God knows you better. He sees you. And he says that he shall be with you always. This word is for somebody. Perhaps you're going through depression right now. Heartache right now. Rejection right now. Pain in your heart right now, confusion, lack of resources, whatever it is, it is that you're going through right now, God knows you, he has seen you. He knew that you will face this situation as time goes on, but it only, it, 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 the outcome will depend on you. Would you give up or would you continue? May God be redone in your life. I see you bouncing back. After a very, very hard season, after, after a very, very hard moment. If it means you going into isolation, taking an alone time to heal yourself and come back, please just do so. Do so. Hallelujah. Do so. Whatever way that you want to, whatever that you want to do to, 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 to heal yourself, to, to get out of a situation, out of your head, or out of your emotional struggles, or out of the pain, just do it. Glory be to God. The Lord your God is with you. And shall always be with you in the name of our Lord and Savior Yahushua Mashiach. Faith is our vehicle and love is our strength. See you in the next video.